The leaves have fallen and the weather is getting chilly. When thinking about access opportunities, you're probably thinking hunting on a wildlife management area or fishing in a trout stream. But I want to remind you that now is a great time to chase a monster lurking in the deep, the muskie. On this episode of Explore the Wild, I'm going to share with you a few spots to get you out muskie fishing in Virginia. The muskie is known as a fish of over a thousand casts, but they're truly exciting to catch. For your best bet, try the western side of the state, but there are muskie in northern Virginia as well. So let's get you out to the fish. The best way to do that is at one of DWR's access sites. If you're interested in fishing rivers, you'll find gravel approaches, and in some cases, concrete ramps to the river. When targeting muskie from these sites, rafts, canoes, and kayaks are the way to go. But under the right water conditions, you can also use John boats with jet drives. In many cases, you'll want to float from one site to the next. So you'll want to plan for some time to shuttle back and forth between the launch and retrieval site. DWR sites that you might want to consider on the New River are Old Town, Austinville, and one of the more popular, Whitethorn. For floating the James, consider Horseshoe Bend to Buchanan, and if you're using a boat, a good option are the pools close to the Reed Creek boat ramp. Also, don't count out trying the Shenandoah River for your next muskie adventure. For more information about these access sites, see the Where to Boat section on DWR's boating page. For access to the lakes that are good for musky fishing, try Hungry Mother or Roar Retreat in Southwest Virginia. For those anglers close to Northern Virginia, Lake Burke is a good bet for some excellent musky fishing. Be sure to hit the areas around the pier and dam at this site. There are plenty of fish to be had with a little perseverance. At these lake sites, you'll find a variety of fishing options to include bank fishing, pier fishing, and concrete ramps for launching and retrieving of paddle craft and boats that are propelled by electric motors only. The rivers can be tricky to navigate. Do your homework ahead of time. Check the water levels and flow gauges. Due to changing site conditions, areas may be accessible by boat one day, but only by raft or canoe or kayak the next. Most importantly, with the cold temperature, you'll want to dress appropriately and wear your life jacket when out on the water at all times. Remember, the outdoors are better together. Take a friend fishing with you. Be sure to let someone know where you plan to be and when you plan to return. For more information about the muskie biology and fishing techniques, see the DWR Muskie Fishing page. We also have a great video on Muskie Fishing 101. And I hope you enjoy exploring the wild as you chase the mighty muskie.